So I'm sure you've heard of AI. We've got several now. We've got ChatGPT, we've got Midjourney, we've got all the other ones that are out there. And so it's time to ask this question as I've been doing a lot of thinking is, do these AI technologies do more good than harm for us in the game development industry? And I'm sure we've all asked ourselves at one time or another, will AI take my job? Now the answer to that, probably not. The question I'm asking is that, are people going to become so reliant on AI that no one wants to learn the jobs rather than is AI going to take the jobs? I'm going to explore these questions in this video, so make sure you stick around till the end. First off, I want to talk about the pros of using AI for Roblox development. The first one is efficiency. If you're trying to meet a certain deadline for your game to be released, or maybe even you're working for someone else, sometimes efficiency can be the number one priority. And since AI is relevant, relatively quick, it can produce AI generated icons and thumbnails and code within seconds, which allows you to focus on other aspects of your game. And there's also accessibility. AI can lower the barrier to entry for aspiring developers, which means that anyone with limited knowledge in a certain subject or even limited funding can use AI to create advanced graphic design or maybe even use AI's coding skills to create visually appealing games sometimes. Which is cool for newer developers. However, the cons of AI and Roblox development, I think, is over-reliance. First off, I think relying on AI too heavily may hinder your creativity depending on how you use it. And I think if it ever gets to the point where we are over-relying on AI, are all the games going to be generic or not? After that, we have limited customization. While AI can create impressive visuals, it's not always going to capture your unique vision. Let's say I was prompting AI with something. I said I wanted a hug with four legs riding down a slide on a beach in Miami, Florida. I don't know, something like that. AI sometimes isn't going to get all those details. At least not yet, at least. It could skip out the slide part. It could skip out the Miami part. It could even skip the pug with four legs. It could make a pug with three legs. However, as AI gets more advanced, I imagine it will have more customization abilities. And then the third and final con that I have thought of for today is, is could it produce a possible learning detriment? This brings me to the most significant concern of mine. Will AI take away the desire to learn developing skills in Roblox? I think it has to do with how you use AI. I've come up with three different perspectives here. So the first perspective is that you're using AI as a learning tool. You want this AI to explain to you a certain subject. You want this AI to maybe help you along and help you fix an error in your code, something like that. And these are great ways to use AI because you're using it as a learning tool to excel your own learning abilities. The second perspective is using AI as a creative companion. So let's say you're a builder in Roblox Studio. You only know a very little amount of scripting and you want to achieve something that you probably don't know how to do just yet. Now, instead of learning how to do it, using the AI to to excel your learning abilities, let's say. Let's say you want to make a kill part in Roblox Studio for your obby that you're making, right? So you only know how to use the touched function in Roblox, all right? So you go over to AI, you say, hey, I want to make a part that kills the player. Here you go. You basically rely on the AI to do the scripting for your game while you're doing everything else, whether that be the building, the game design, the graphics and illustrations, all those things. And then this brings us to the third perspective, using AI as a crutch. My concern is that some people might become complacent, relying solely on AI generated content. If developers no longer feel the need to acquire traditional skills, it could lead to a decline in the diversity and richness of not only Roblox experiences, but also Roblox UGC items and clothing and all sorts of different things. So in conclusion, I think AI has brought tremendous benefits to Roblox development. It's increased efficiency, accessibility, and all sorts of other things. However, its impact on the desire to learn Roblox development could be a complex issue. Ultimately, the answer to whether AI will take away the desire to learn Roblox development depends on how it's integrated into the creative process. I think the key is to use AI as a tool to enhance your skills rather than as a crutch that you lean on in order to build or develop. That brings me to my last question. What do you think? Will AI take away the desire to learn Roblox development or will it continue to 
be a powerful ally for developers? Share your thoughts in the comments. I'll try and respond to as many as I can. Make sure you like, subscribe, and comment down below. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.